Monday mornings up here is so quiet. It's just so quiet when you're not around. But anyway, you can't be here because you're supposed to be at school or you're supposed to be at work. And wherever you are, I hope you're shining the life of Jesus this morning. This is the week. This coming Saturday, we leave for Friendsgiving, and I am very excited about it. Uh, me and Chris Ferguson have been meeting together for a couple of months now, and we're looking forward to it. Went over last week and saw our camp area. Uh, just can't wait. It's going to be a blast, and we want you to be a part of it. A couple of things I want you to specifically specifically pray for pray for health we've got some folks that aren't feeling well uh, and we want them 100% so they can be a part of this amazing weekend so just pray for people's health pray for our worship leader Connor Lane Connor Lane's First Baptist Clinton uh, used to be here at West End Baptist and he is just gonna I am so excited to hear Connor lead us in worship pray for our small group leaders pray for the ones that will be speaking uh, pray for each other uh, that God would do something special in the heart. I believe he's going to, but we have to have an open heart to receive what it is that he's got for us. So be in prayer for all of those things. I want to thank you all that were here last night to pack for Operation Christmas Child. Uh, me and the First Lady at Crossroads did a little weekend getaway just to try to get refreshed for everything that's coming up between <clears throat> Friendsgiving and February. We've got stuff coming up in February that we haven't even talked to you about yet. So a lot of stuff coming up, a lot of stuff going on. We need a little getaway to get my mind straight and get ready for that. Uh, but you were here and you packed for Operation Christmas Child and I can't begin to thank you enough. I've said this so many times. I believe with all of my heart that one day in heaven um, there's going to be somebody walk up to you and say you packed a box one time and it came all the way to my country and because you packed that box I'm here today. I believe that's going to happen so thank you for your willingness to serve. Uh, thank you to Mr. Brian Smith and Miss Benita Hallmark for hooking us up and getting all this pulled together. Uh, wonderful. Thank you to the First Lady of Crossroads for all the shopping you did. Thank you. Do want to remind you that this coming Wednesday night is our final night in the Ten Commandments. Um, every week I've said this has been a difficult one to, to get my mind wrapped around. It's a difficult one to speak on. This is probably the one that I struggle the most with. If you struggle with one, you struggle with all of them. <clears throat> but this one really hits home. And I've got a confession to make. I'm going to make a com confession during Crossroads. So make sure that you're here, not just to hear my confession, but to hear what God's got to say about what the Ten Commandments are. And uh, Crossroads, I love you. Looking forward to this weekend getaway with you guys as we get ready for Thanksgiving. Let the holidays begin. See you.